after receiving the the telegram, um, uh, we said good our goodbyes to our to our families. My grandparents really had raised my sister and me. My father is an auto mechanic. He went to work every day. My mother was uh, a housewife. I had no idea that I would ever even get a college educa education, much less become a dean of a major research university. My name is Gerardo Gonzalez. Uh, I was born in a town called Placetas in Las Villas, Cuba. Uh, I came to this country at the age of uh, 11 years old uh, with my parents and a younger sister after the Castro Revolution. Uh, we arrived um, in Miami as uh, Cuban refugees. Uh, our life completely changed. We struggled, um, you know, I didn't speak any English. February 9, 1962, the last stamp. It was there in Miami, too, that I had a school experience that uh, changed my life. It was so painful and transformative. The principal ran to me, grabbed me by my arm, took me to the front of the room, and is shaking me. The schools wanted us to be Americans and act like Americans. We, we had no idea what an American act like. He took me out of the class. On the way out, though, the teacher interrupted and gently said something to the vice principal. Felt like she knew. This kid could go places. Experiences that I had are universal. Immigrants and refugees, wherever they come from, whatever their circumstances, they want to make sure that their children have opportunities that they don't have. And for immigrants, the door is education. Education is more than just preparation for a job, it's preparation for life. The one thing that I hope you remember, if nothing else, if this kid could go places, all kids could go places. And you can be that person who makes a difference and gives them the kinds of opportunity that this kid has happened.